is on um, December the 12th, 2014, uh, at the Wings Cafe on 2822 Bloomfield Drive. Uh, two um, rival games are making uh, the Crips and the Black Team, which are also considered uh, gangster disciples out of the Bloomfield area. The week leading up to the 12th, Your Honor, they had had several altercations between members of the two groups. Um, this is an ongoing feud between these two groups um, from a murder that happened back in 2010 with Rodney and Gary. Um, since that murder and since that prosecution, uh, the groups of the black team have been at each other and trying to get retaliation from both sides, basically. And in the days leading up to the 12th of uh, December, there had been for, um, some instances, one at club status, I think, um, that has been documented as well. Uh, on the evening of the 12th, um, this did happen at Wings Cafe on Bluefield Drive. Wings Cafe is considered a um, known crip gang hideout or club. They go and hang out. And um, several individuals of the crip gang were there that night, um, including one of the co-defendants, Jock West Foster, and one of the deceased members, Corey Hodge, in this case. Uh, there is quite an extensive amount of video surveillance cameras and coverage in this case. You can see black team coming in the parking lot. Um, you can see them kind of conspiring and getting ready to go in. They talk to one of the bouncers. Uh, they come into the club uh, at the very front. As soon as they get there, they're in a very tight group. Um, numbers. Uh, Group members from the back of the club come up to confront them. Um, there is a confrontation. There's some words being passed. A uh, cigarette is split. A fight breaks out. Uh, security see When the fight breaks out, security responds. They try to pepper spray or mace several of the individuals. Uh, shortly thereafter, um, numerous handguns were pulled from both groups, from both the crypt group inside the club and from the black team group um, that had just arrived to come in the door. Uh, at that point, it was basically a gun battle like you would have an OJ Corral. And my client actually has an LLC that's registered with the state of Georgia. He has met, and I asked the detective about this, he's met with the mayor, he's met the city council as to what they do. It's a charitable scenario, and we have evidence of that. Um, part of the... Uh, he has an LLC corporation, how does how does that factor into what we're... Well, what they're saying is that this this gang they, is a criminal enterprise. Mm -hmm. He actually had a LLC in the name of this. The which, black team? Yes. Yes, sir. Which indicates what he does. I've got pictures where they, they do charitable work. They do car washes. They do, prints, they do uh, fish fries. Uh, they give up. Uh, <coughs> to me. We're in the video. You have a client coming in. Somebody swings at him. He defends himself. And he swings back. And then the two other people, one in the back, one in the front, they pull out guns. My client, and even the detective indicated that my client ran, he ran into the women's bathroom. He's a big gang member. He ran into the women's bathroom, and that was it. We have a dozen witnesses, four of whom will testify that Mr. Watkins was not there that night, including the bartender who has known him for years, not a year or two, who has no special strong association with Mr. Watkins as opposed to somebody who presumably flies different colors, who <coughs> testify that when he shows that there's only one access and egress... Excuse me, what do you mean by flies different colors? Some people wear black, some wear blue, some wear Oh, okay. Okay, oh, yes, he's considering that witness was a crib. Oh, okay. Versus black. An association of uh, uh, identifying with him. Um, uh, who says he wasn't there that night. And that bartender is absolutely positive. In fact, that bartender met with Detective Pinson. Did not want to be recorded because of all of these different colors flying. and didn't want to get in trouble, but spent a considerable amount of time with Detective Pinson. Also, the person with whom uh, Mr. Watkins was that night from 1.30 on and spent the night with uh, went and gave a statement to the Texas Texan and, and met with him considerably and put that statement on the record. We have right now watching uh, the two uh, people who were with Mr. Watkins all night that night. They never went to Wings Cafe and they are here willing to testify 